Mr. John Wilson with Double Nickel Taxidermy. Tell me about axes, antlers, particularly in velvet, or any other antlers in velvet. Sure. How do they get them to you so that right. they can be properly done to show actually what they look like? Sure. Well, antlers and velvet come in a couple of different varieties. You get the uh, the soft velvet like these where the, the, the tips are real bulbous. There's a lot of blood and soft material in there. And then you get the, the antlers that are a little more further along in their development like this one here. And uh, you treat those a little differently. Um, first and foremost, just like the cape and the hide, you want to make sure it stays cool and as dry as possible. Um, I tell people to treat your, your animal, your trophy, like it, you would a steak you're gonna eat that night. You wanna keep it cool. If the temperature starts getting a little questionable, uh, you probably wanna add ice to it or, or turn the cooler down a little bit. So uh, just keep them cool if you can. I know they're big. It's hard to keep them in an ice chest. If you can't do that, get to a taxidermist as soon as you can um, and get them frozen or chilled. Cause like I said, there's blood up underneath all this stuff. And if you don't cure that, it'll start to rot and you'll know about it pretty quickly and the velvet will slip off. So uh, we typically, to preserve them in velvet, we'll, we'll have them freeze dried when they're real soft like this. Uh, that's the best option. Um, there are some other avenues. Some people inject uh, different formulas up into the velvet, between the velvet and the, the skin of the, antler, or of the velvet. And uh, that will generally, push out the blood and in all the nasty stuff uh, and leave underneath the preservative. That's kind of tricky because if you don't get it all, then the velvet's going to slip and start smelling. So uh, the best option is going to be to have them freeze dried. If not, you can buy kits and do it yourself, but you just need to make sure you do it thoroughly. John, what's the best way to get in touch with you? You can get us. Uh, our website's doublenickeltaxidermy.com. We have Facebook, uh, Instagram, call us at the shop, 830-237-9481. Thank you very much. Thank you.